Well, folks, I'm here at the Vintage Bistro with Arianna Gillis. Hello. Arianna Gillis is an Ontario-born uh, woman, she's originally from Vineland, Ontario. Yep. And uh, she's been doing her craft for the past two years, haven't you? Because you won about two or three years. Because I've seen that you've won some Niagara Awards too, last year, 2010 Best Female Vocalist. Album, that's album. Thank you. Um, 2009 you won Songwriter. Songwriter yeah. Award, did you? And then also in 2009 they had another distinction. The Canadian Folk Music Award. And you also got the further distinction that this year's Victoria Day Remembrance uh, celebrations that were going on. CTV actually aired one of your songs. Yeah. From oh, did they? Bridges of Bridges of Hi, which is track number five on your disc. This is your disc. Okay. Okay. So, Ariana, as I ask all the artists I get the chance to actually sit down and have discussions with, okay. apart from your near death experience with pneumonia, Mm -hmm. uh, Are we set to order? Uh, another zestful another what no, worries. no worries. No worries. So are you with the baby? Um, yes. As well? Are you I was set? Um, okay. very inspired. My dad has always been playing music in the house. The house. So, um, the pot pie it's just kind of been nothing until fall. In my they were our winter. Oh, oh, sorry. Our whole family, my sister. Are they still on there? Is that a winter item? Six years old. Yeah. Sorry about that. I just grew from there. I took it to the guitar and I started writing songs. And now I'm at where I'm at right now. I'm, I'm assuming that your whole fan of the Yellow's fan is entirely going to be in the car. Pretty much, yeah, a lot of it. Because you have a sister on the that also plays music, doesn't you? Yeah, Briar. Because I remember you have a website, you have a YouTube channel, and that's where I caught with them. your sister's channel. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> what do you know? <laughs> sure. I'm a big YouTube fanatic <laughs> myself, so. No. Um, right. Now. Would you like a side salad as well? Who, out of all the musical talent okay. that we have in Canada, or internationally to speak, um, any specific artist that actually decided to affect you in any way? Oh, sorry. Um, sorry, can we just, uh, okay, um, he wanted, I got him, he, he wanted a soup as well. Oh, a soup as well? Sure. And, um, can I get, um, the bistro salad with the, the mango dressing on the side? Absolutely. Would you like chicken on your salad? Sorry about that. No <laughs> problem. Out of all the musical influences that you've listened to since you've been growing up, any particular one that you actually hold to heart to influence you just a very grand liking? Like an like artist. Um, one you want to ask. Specifically because of the music that they write, the way they play it. Patty Griffin. Patty Griffin, I started listening to her when I was really young, probably about 12 years old. and. I love her music. Her, her songwriting is just so skillfully crafted, and uh, her melodies are beautiful. And I really took a lot of her music and I incorporated it to my own as well. Like without stealing anything, it just became such a part of me that it just comes out naturally, right? And that happens with a lot of stuff that I listen to without even knowing about it. I just take all these different, you know, pieces of different artists, and they are who I am now. Now. You've been on tour for how long so far? Um, about a week now. Yeah. So you traveled from Vineland, Ontario? We actually did a show in um, Kentucky first. Um, so we were all the way down in the States and we had a, we did a street concert festival thing. And um, we did a radio interview there as well. And uh, the, day, the night we came home, the next morning we left to come out here. So. Was it on the 28th or the 29th? Yeah, we, left, we came back on Sunday night. We left Monday morning. So. Well, remember you sent a Twitter commit message right. when you were off from Nova Scotia. Yes. So, uh, out of the album now, I've, I've noticed that your songs are quite no, not easy in the year. Oh, good. You've got, you've, not, you've got literally speaking, they're, they're exquisite. You know what? I think you can ask for 
Uh, okay, I'll put it through and then. Okay, but also. Uh, uh, lyrically, but uh, musically, they're even more so. Mm. Uh, I need Starting specific songs. I don't know all the whole. Uh, folks, for those of you that don't have a CD, it's, it's worth the cheese. investment. Well, it's a 12 track CD. Oh, it doesn't matter. So, do the cheese? Okay. Containing lots of songs. Okay. <laughs> the dynamic track no, starting with no problem. I'll come out. Blueberry Ocean and then ending with Down in the Rain, which actually mellows down the album. Uh, from my understanding, it was written and arranged by you, uh, by you, actually written by you and arranged with your father. Yes. So.